It's me again, Sarah, Chief Executive of the Trust, and I just wanted to do my final video blog to you all uh, as we're running up to Christmas to say a huge thank you for all the hard work that every single one of you has put in throughout 2019. It feels as though it's been a really busy, tough year. Uh, everyone's working flat out and really hard, and I just want you to know that that really is appreciated. But you've achieved such a huge amount, making a difference to the lives of the people that we serve big change programmes, redesigning our community mental health services, which is already having an impact. The work on improving our acute care services, again, the feedback that I'm getting is that's really starting to make a difference, but nonetheless, there's still a huge amount we need to do. Setting up the new gambling service, now providing a service that never previously existed, and that will grow in 2020. The behind the scenes work that's going on, refurbishing all of our uh, premises that these states teams are doing, often overlooked but hugely appreciated. These are all important steps that we're taking year on year to make the services that we provide better but also to make things better for our staff and that's been part of the work that we're doing through the Culture Collaborative and again I just want to thank all of those staff that took the time to get involved with the online platform and that's going to inform the work that we do in 2020. So as we're coming up to Christmas, I thank you. I hope you're all feeling proud of yourselves for what you have achieved. Um, over Christmas, I want as many of you as possible to spend time with your loved ones, family and friends, pets, whoever that may be. Uh, take the time that you can just to have some space for yourself uh, and enjoy some much needed relaxation. But of course, there will also be many of you that are still working over Christmas. We do provide 24-7 services. So to those staff that are sacrificing time with your loved ones to cover our inpatient wards, our crisis teams across the Trust, uh, a huge thank you. Um, it really is appreciated. And when you're not at work, again, make the most of the time that you've got with your family and your loved ones. So thinking ahead then, 2020, I can't give any guarantees that it's going to be less busy than this year has been. Um, but I know that whatever 2020 throws at us, you will all get behind one another and make sure that we do the best that we possibly can. So there's only one last thing that I need to do, and that is to be able to introduce a song that our fantastic staff choir, who have only recently formed and give their first performance at our Trust Awards, have agreed to do a Christmas song for all of our colleagues at Leeds and York Partnership Foundation Trust, and I shall hand over to them uh, to take this message out. Merry Christmas, everybody, and here's to a fabulous 2020. So happy.